So the whole idea is that the architecture is an integrated uh, process uh, of uh, creating uh, a building that uh, integrates itself very well with the with the place. What I mean by the place is the uh, is the surrounding, is the people, is the culture, is the social and cultural values of the people, of the political and I would say economical um, um, uh, elements. And the idea is how you could uh, bring all of this together and to create an architecture that is uh, for people, that creates a better space and better environment for the people. So, so how you look uh, up at the, the situation, at the future of the Islamic architecture in the country like India? I think it's quite, um, from what I saw the presentation today, it's quite uh, very progressive. Um, uh, again, so the, the idea of uh, Islamic architecture, I mean, if you see, uh, always, uh, it's, it's different from place to place, it's different from time to time, but what's important, there are certain values, the social and cultural values that has been respected. And the presentation I saw today, uh, before the lunch, it was a great example of that, of how you could uh, define a contemporary uh, kind of uh, Islamic or um, architecture within today's uh, uh, world. Especially because India is having a background, like especially in the medieval period, there were structures like uh, a very good example of structures in Islamic architecture. There was still uh, the development which we which required in this uh, field still not going in that way. Now it's a kind of revival which is going on. So how do you look at it? Well, I think I think it's being progressive. Uh, again, we cannot. Um, I mean, there is this notion when we look at the Islamic uh, architecture. You refer to arches, and domes, and minarets, uh, which are mainly, I would say, uh, as our physical element uh, of uh, of architecture. Uh, but architecture is much more deeply rooted, uh, I would say, uh, in society. So you cannot define architecture just by uh, Islamic architecture by the look of it, but but there are social uh, and other uh, religious values that uh, has been defining it over time, uh, and that's why I mean sometimes you see Islamic architecture in India or in Indonesia or in China, they're quite uh, uh, different, uh, but all of them they share the similar social 